Welcome to School Report, a glimpse into the classrooms of St. Lucie County Public Schools. School Report provides the opportunity to share with the community academic and extracurricular activities of students in our schools. And now, here is School Report. to school specialist for St. Lucie Public Schools. Today we are here at the second annual student culinary cook-off where Childhood Nutrition Services has partnered with um, the culinary arts department um, at four of our high schools and two of our middle schools to showcase our students' ability. Um, the reason that we're able to do this event is because um, we have been granted the Farm to School Award. So that brings in local produce that our students are gonna be cooking with today and the winner of the event, their entree, gets to be put on the line uh, for all of our cafeterias throughout the district. And then we'll uh, enjoy some desserts uh, from two of our middle schools again. Um, we're very honored and lucky to be here today and we hope you enjoy the cook-off as much as uh, we're excited for. Ingersoll, St. Lucie County School Board member, and I'm here at Treasure Coast High School to judge our high school's food uh, competition. Their culinary arts are uh, the best of the best of our, of our community. And uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to be looking at different types of food. I see that they have pork. I'm going to be looking at the texture of the pork, the taste of the pork, the flavor of the pork, what kind of spices are using, and uh, just to see uh, different, different ways of cooking it and different ways of making it. And it's going to be an exciting time. I can't wait to just to taste this food. Um, a couple of the middle schools, Northport Middle School, St. Lucie West K-8 made some cookies and different types of desserts. And uh, it's going to be interesting. I saw sweet potato cookies back there and a different type of dessert. So uh, yeah, I can't wait. Some of the other things we'll be looking for too will be creativity and appearance of the food. Just making sure that it's plated well in the plate, making sure that the starch, the vegetables, and the meat are, uh, are, are, 
has a great presentation. Um, the other things we're looking for uh, during this competition is how the school works together with our teams. Each team will have about four to five kids per school, making sure everyone on the teams has a specific duty and they're uh, putting forth good effort. seasonings into the pork and also put that in the oven to bake it. Then once we have that, we go on top, once it's all done, we go over and have flatbread, put a little bit more barbecue sauce, pork, uh, salsa, uh, cabbage, fresh cabbage, fresh red peppers, and then we go on over and just put a little bit of cheese sauce and we go and put the, uh, the fresh thyme that we just got. Nice and uh, thin, 
so you can drizzle over top rope for a Again, 